Anyhow, guess what I'm fixing to do? Yep, you guessed it. I don't know if this is right or not. Too late now. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of hair. All right, I did it. You guys, I think I've lost my freaking mind. I, I had to have lost my mind. You guys, look what I just did. <laughs> oh my gosh, I haven't done this. Oh, I got hair in my mouth in years. I used to always have bangs. I wonder if I make. I keep chomping and chomping and chomping. And I said, okay, I gotta stop. Because uh, I don't, if I keep going, it's going to be way over here, and I can't have that. So I don't think it looks bad. It feels better. She saw the camera, and she turned around. This girl has not stopped staring at me for the past 10 minutes, just straight at my bangs. She doesn't, she can't believe it. Well, I'll go, she came over here and started smelling of them, and then she kissed me. <laughs> See what I mean? It's mommy. You silly girl. It's mommy. I mean, this has been going on forever. Oh, how funny. I'm not going to sit here and film this, but I'm not kidding you. She won't quit staring at me. Hey, you guys. Y'all know I skip around in my rooms. That's just one of the pillowcase shams. I love the green for these end tables and then have this like an off-white or something. <sighs> I'm just so weird. This doesn't match those curtains at all, but I love it. I can't help it. But see, I need to do something with this table. Our end tables are hideous. Uh, I just was going to, I had an idea. I had, the, you know, those ugly black nightstands next to my bed. Anyway, I started adding white and stuff and got the green chalk paint muted down more. Anyway, I started looking at these <laughs> drawers. And let me show you something. Hold on. Okay. Now, rem remember, these have already been painted, okay? And they look terrible. A really bad job. But you can see there's oak underneath there, right? The back of these, okay, they're all stamped. They're duct tail is that what you call them i don't know how you call it what you call it right there that stuff okay and they've got hold on this is the wrong one let me get the other one i'm gonna repaint them because they're already painted but look it says john stewart john stewart furniture anyway i'm looking them up and i've seen some by themselves a thousand dollars and then I saw a set for like four thousand. I'm like, dude, what? There's no way. I remember me and Jeremy got this when we used to go to auctions all the time. I mean like crappy auctions. <laughs> like poor people auction auctions, excuse me. That we paid forty dollars for the pair. And we have enjoyed them tremendously for years and years. But they're just gotten so beat up up here. I thought, okay, well I'm gonna start painting these while I sit here because I don't feel so hot today, okay? But now I was like, oh, crap. Jeremy goes, well, they were already painted, so you haven't heard them. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and finish painting them. <laughs> but isn't that awesome? But now that I, I know that, I kind of am thinking I'm going to sand this top part and maybe just stain it and then do the green on the bottom. But period, I mean, I'm not selling them. So unless it came down to dire straits, you know, I would. But it's pretty interesting. I, I had no idea these were worth a thing. Okay, let me finish. And Jeremy went to go get us something to eat. Man, I was not planning on sanding. <laughs> oh, wow. I'd have to put some paint strip on this sucker. Well, I mean, I could use a finer grit, but... Mm. Yeah, this will take forever. I ain't done painting them. <laughs> I ain't going through all that. Here I go doing stuff in the dark again. <laughs> Let's see. That was so pretty. It is really a solid table. I've enjoyed. 
excuse me, hiccups. I enjoy them because of this lip. Because I'm the worst at uh, knocking bottles off or uh, bottle waters off and it'll catch them and then I have time to catch it. Or glasses. I don't put glasses on here. I knock them off. Because I reach for stuff when I'm really in a deep sleep and I'll knock them off on the floor. I do it every time. All right, let me get something to dry that with. My paper towel here. I need lint free, but I don't care. One thing is, oh, I like it. It's a lot smoother, that's for sure. Kind of rough there, water damage or something, but. All right, let me wash the rest of it real good and put a coat of paint on it. Turn on the light, too. I done got hot now. I'm just going to do the top on camera, and then I'll just do the rest later. I'm going to do the... No, I'm not using my other brush. I'm tired. Of... I got to get used to that crap. Plus, I don't feel like washing it. It's in the water. <laughs> Pretty much. That's why. Mm -hmm. Boy, I, now that I know what this is, I hate painting it, but it's going to look a lot better than it did. <laughs> what is it, Piggy? How come every time I start recording? Hmm? Golly, I love this green. I don't know what it is about this color green, but it is so pretty to me. I don't know. can't explain it. When my fish get hungry and, you, and they start splashing around, like, because it's almost 5 o'clock. That's when I feed them, 5 to 5.30. They're on the schedule. <laughs> Their light comes on at, their uh, daylight comes on at uh, 8, between 8 and 8.30. It goes off at 6 to 6.30. It goes in on the blue. And then about 8, 9 o'clock, it goes to black. I just turn them completely off. Because I want them, you know, to have as much normalcy as they can in an aquarium. They're happy about it. They've never known anything other than that. So, it wasn't like we took them out of the wild. chalk paint I'd be freaking out right now with all these streaks but I know chalk paint now the second the first cut always looks bad the second one gets real good coverage so I think I need to just do what I said and go around it and then do the inside with a bigger one <laughs> Jeremy was watching me do the shelves a while ago before he left, and he was like, because he used to be a painter. Oh, you got a drip. I said, I know. Oh, you got a drip. I was like, okay. You going to get that drip? And I said, all right, I'm going to get the drip. Yeah, but it's on the, I said, it's just on the inside. He goes, doesn't matter, drip's drip. I'm getting it. Don't worry. Wiped right off. I said, Jeremy, it's chalk paint. Until you seal it, you can get it off with water. Drip's a drip. All right. Go get us something to get out of here. I hate I have to do the back. This is like, you're not even going to see the back. But, I guess you got to to make it right. professional chalk paint artist, y'all be like, yeah, duh. 
right now. It's about right now. This is incredible. Game changer for me. Game changer. Okay, I got all of it done, and I did the cat the uh, drawers. Let's do the top. Oh wow! Oh, I always see that. Oh wow! Mm -hmm. it definitely eats up a lot of paint, but it holds a lot of paint. Oh, don't fall! I'm on a ladder. <laughs> Okay, spread this all around. I don't want thick coats, so this will be fine. I'm just going to spread it in. Well, we got the windows and doors open. As you can see, I still got bangs. They've grown out a little bit, but I've been going like this, and they stay back. I don't like them because my hair's too fine, but they'll grow out. It's not that big of a deal. And as you can see behind me, I've got my second nightstand. I think this, well, I've already put one coat on it, and this was like several days ago, but my stomach's been hurting, so I'm doing it today, and we'll finish it. It's funny, the more you paint, the more you start using the same things, like this little thing right here. It's not false craft. Is that what you, how you pronounce it? Anyway, I have a whole set of these things, and... The cups are way too small. I used one plate. I don't know where the plates went. I used one little coffee cup. I'll spill them, so. And that's for water. And then this is just for setting my paintbrushes in when I switch them out, because I use both. So, let me get the paint and shake it. Not be back. I'm gonna start at the top with the big brush, and then I'm gonna use the little brush. Well, that guy's out there shooting again. I tell you what, Shasta was shaking like crazy, but Jeremy went to the store, so he took her with him. <sighs> As usual, I've got to strain it, so here we go. And that ought to be good for the whole thing, I would imagine. I lied. I'm going to start at the bottom of the legs. No, actually, i got to start on these tops. I'm going to go in sequence here. <laughs> Just wipe it on top of here real quick. Wow, what a difference a second coat makes. I love it when I get to this point. I forgot to put these under my legs. I had another one. Where'd it go? It. Okay, I'm gonna distress it. It's dry enough, and then tomorrow I'm gonna I'm gonna wait all night after I distress it, and then uh, tomorrow I'll wax it. Mm -hmm. Not the black show, not the wood. started waxing one drawer already and it looks amazing. I got up this morning and I, some of the distress parts I didn't like so I repainted a little tiny you know, bit on the scratches I made so I still got to sand those down but I can do the drawers. I did one just now and I'm really liking it. I hadn't wiped it off yet so I'm going to do the other one on camera real quick. I made my new brush this one. Uh, my designated clear brush so clear wax. I'm just going to wipe it on here. I'm going to leave it this time. I haven't been leaving it. I just wipe it off immediately. I'm supposed to leave it, I think, for like 20 minutes. I don't I do not do well in take, uh, listening to others. <laughs> Should have figured it out for myself. So we're going to leave this on here. If I like it, I might redo those uh, slats because they're way too green still. Oh, 
That didn't get hair in it. I know it probably did. Show y'all what I did. And I was looking at Kacha. K-A-C-H-A. She is an amazing painter. I guess she does YouTube for a living, but oh, she's amazing. She's got Dixie Bell and everybody sponsoring her, so she's really good. Anyhow, this is what she does. If you put the black wax on, this is what she said. Put the black wax on before you add clear. You can't get it off if you don't like it. So, always put the clear on first, and then you can uh, wipe it off. Probably not doing very good on showing y'all, but a tutorial. Let me show you though how this looks. I don't know if you can see it. Like where the black marks are. Dark. Look at that. And that's where the handle is. So I'm going to add a little bit there. And I'm going to let this sit. And then I'm going to come back to it. And wipe it off here shortly. I don't think that looks bad at all. Hmm. Well, I'm done. I've polished and polished as much as I can. I don't have the cabinet, the drawers in there yet. Or the knobs on there good. But it's pretty good. I like it. I don't like the glamorous knobs I've got on here, but I'm going to get some smaller ones. <laughs> and uh, I think it turned out good. Really like it. It's cute. So yeah, I'll sh I'm going to go in there and uh, vacuum and I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to put that new bedspread on because really only one dog still gets up on there and I'm covering it up every day with a blanket that we've got that I roll out every night. It's a pain in the butt, but it's been keeping my bedspread a lot cleaner. So I think I'm going to do that see what it looks like. I'm getting ready to go to bed, and I wanted to show y'all the preciousness of this. Look at that, sisters. Aren't they sweet? I love these girls. I kiss them both separately every night. I tell them I love them, and God bless you, and I'll see y'all in the morning. And that's what's fixing to happen. <laughs>